And so actually I found a guy who is a specialist in it and he does like 10 a day. So uh, it was a Filipino guy. Oh yeah. That's the guy you want. Yep. And it was either that, it was either a Jewish guy or a Filipino guy that I was doing it with. No, but, you get a gay dude. You get a gay doctor to do that because if anybody's going to treat your penis with respect and care, it's going to be a gay dude. <laughs> and he's going to make it look real nice. I yeah. think so. Yeah. Give you a nice haircut after. Well, I, I didn't uh, come out with like weird stitch marks or anything, but it was pretty rough because uh, for like a week, I like couldn't move very much. And the people that were supposed to take care of me in the surgery, they bailed yeah. last second. People. Yeah. So I don't uh, yeah, It teaches you. How long did you have to let it rest? Like, were you able to like before you were able to start banging again? Uh, that. Oh, I don't even remember, but it was like. I think it was like a month or two months. Wow. Eh? It was long. You know, my father and my ex-father-in-law had the same thing at like 60 years old. He had to go get circumcised. It's like very bizarre.